our founder over 100 years ago set out with a clear vision, which was to fill the earth with the light and warmth of hospitality. He really believed that he could make the world a better place through travel. And we continue to believe in that and it guides us every day. Hilton delivers service across the world to everyone. We put smiles on everyone's faces and really makes a great place for anyone to stay anywhere in the world. Hilton, it's all about hospitality, but it's not just how we treat our guests. It really comes through in how we treat each other. It really helps us to deliver and innovate that baseline hospitality towards each other. Hilton has a history of innovation, whether that's a pina colada invented at one of our hotels, the brownie invented at one of our hotels, to things like televisions in your room and, and air conditioning. There's more people traveling with their families, they're traveling with their children, and they are staying for longer. When we see the data around more people in the room, when we see the data around longer length of stays, that means that we ne then need to pivot how we are providing the right sort of amenities, products, and services, like our new confirmed connecting room product. It's really impactful as a mom, having the confidence that when I'm staying at a hotel with my children, that we're gonna be able to be next to each other. We're enabling customers Customers to use their device to pick their room from a floor plan before they arrive with us, check in, uh, use their phone as their key so they can bypass the front desk and then ultimately check out at the end of their stay if they don't want to without engaging a team member uh, at all. You know, we unlock all the data flowing in these customer interactions, tapping into these trends of increasingly customers wanting to use their devices to enable them to have choice and control. The way we really empower that is through a superior data and analytics uh, environment. Across the entire industry, we've brought best-in-class access to data that cuts across all of our various products and all of our various teams across our company and bring that in really simple ways to drive decisions for our hotel owners, managers, uh, and really create a better guest experience. MicroStrategy has helped us take all of this explosion of data, structure it, effectively in a way that we can provide it back to frontline team members, uh, business managers, strategy leaders across the company so that they can use it to make their decisions. And to me, that's where the power is. Our MicroStrategy tools have empowered consistency. We know that no matter what team you're on, you're getting access to the best, most up-to-date information that's really been uh, designed and fit for purpose. It's allowed us to really up our game in, in doing more advanced forms of analytics and deeper dives into performance across our portfolio. Through reporting with MicroStrategy, we've started to create digital key analytics and to look for ways to better engage with customers and actually drive more adoption of digital key across our hotels. We've been able to build on a really strong analytics foundation to deliver much deeper customer analytics to support the business. And MicroStrategy was foundational in our ability to do that, to democratize the data, to enable business users to have access to that data, to be able to understand their KPIs and their metrics and how the business was performing. Our whole success is built on customer-centric innovation finding pain points that customers have or things that they love, and then evolving our brands, our products, our service culture, and our technology to meet and exceed those needs. That's all about how you collect data, how you turn it into insights, and then how you then integrate it back into the action of your business. It's the core of our success. Welcome to the stage, Senior Vice President of Commercial Strategy, Insights, and Analytics at Hilton, Jess Pettit. Thank you for having me, and welcome to our beautiful properties here in Orlando. I'm sincerely grateful that you all are here, and it's not something we should ever take for granted again. It sounds right to say now, uh, but our industry was dramatically impacted by the pandemic. With the initial months driving our business as much as 85% down, Think about that. There's not a whole lot left when you're down about 85%. Causing the closure of about a few thousand hotels and leading to a situation where hope seemed very distant. And so I'm forever grateful for the people who work at these hotels, uh, now redefined as frontline workers. And I hope you express your gratitude and empathy in your travels. I spent a couple years working the front desk, housekeeping, engineering, and the like, and I can't think of a more challenging job. So I'd, I'd like you to please join me quickly in just thanking the team here at the Bonnet Creek Properties and everybody who's put on this event uh, for making this possible.
In-person events like these aren't just the cornerstone of our business. They represent about 20% of our revenue we generate across the globe. But they're importantly, I believe, a critical part of the human fabric and just getting stuff done. Our founder, Conrad Hilton, uh, used to utter the phrase, world peace through travel. And in that, that he meant the most powerful connections we share are when we are together. That brings us to an event like this. So I believe, and I, I think hopefully you all do as well, there's simply no better way to engage, to learn, or network uh, than being together. And I applaud MicroStrategy for being a leader in technology by investing in experiences like this. There aren't many companies like this right now in the technology space, so thank you to MicroStrategy. And I certainly can't imagine tonight wandering through Universal Studios on Zoom. Uh, that would not have been a whole lot of fun. So that's the physical. It's the critical and irreplaceable part of our business. For over 100 years, we've innovated in the physical experience, as you heard that guy say in the video just a few minutes ago. Uh, I almost wore that same shirt, decided not to, so I'm grateful for that. Uh, but we've been innovating in that space for, for uh, over 100 years. The first central reservation centers, uh, color TVs, the brownie, and everybody's favorite warm double tree cookie plus some well-intended ideas that didn't work and maybe were ahead of their time, like Lady Hilton, the women's only hotel brand of the 1960s. One way or the other, we've been a leader by constantly innovating. And so we believe that we do that today, and what makes us different is how we innovate and invest in the digital experience. For your stay at this hotel, we've innovated across the customer journey. First by allowing you to purchase the right product, allowing you to confirm a connecting room, something I'm guessing not too many of you all did, uh, given the nature and circumstances of this trip, but I'm not here to judge. You had the ability to confirm a connecting room with one of your coworkers, I guess. Uh, then as your stay approached, you had the access to choose your room, maybe get a free upgrade, and then as you arrive on site, leverage digital key, as you get into your room, leverage our, our smart television product and using your, your phone as your remote. And then finally, checking out via digital checkout. As we innovate, we also raise the stakes. We create more potential touch points, which means more potential points of failure. That feedback loop is absolutely critical to constant improvement. So combining that physical and digital experience is a powerful thing. It's worthy of its own term. It's fidgetal. In the center of this Venn diagram is the power to enhance the human experience, to find ways to leverage the power of technology to reduce friction in our daily lives. And that's our ultimate goal. Identifying the unnecessary points of friction is at the core of our for the stay messaging. And so, sometimes when you go to the front desk, you want to interact, ask questions. Sometimes you just want to go straight to your room and ignore everyone in sight. It may matter what floor to you, what, what may matter to you what floor your room is on, or you may want some towels brought to your room, but you don't want to actually pick up the phone. When you want a frictionless experience, we believe when the little things make all the difference, it matters where you stay. And so what we're doing is not just a data analytics program, and I think that's really critical to think about here. What we're talking about is deeply integrated in everything that we do. Last year, Hilton doubled down on the stay experience uh, with our For The Stay marketing platform, which I'm hopeful many of you all have seen. While travel is full of experiences, we're focused on what we can deliver during your time in our hotels in ways that differentiates us from our competitors. And staying in a hotel is a deeply personal thing. You're, you're staying in, in one of our beds. And so we sincerely believe that it matters where you stay when you expect those little things to make a big difference. And data is what enables that. So when it comes to the use of data, we're all familiar with the constant debate between personalization and creepiness. And I'm sure there are many in this room who fall on either, either end of that spectrum. A data-driven guest experience cuts across the customer journey, dreaming and searching before you stay, and then enhancing your in-stay experience. We do this through all the buzzwords, which I hope everyone here is familiar. AI empowered next best action that predicts needs to deliver the right message at the right time. Say that three times fast. It's something that we're all sort of striving for. The reality is, is that no one's quite tapped into that full power of data across the customer journey. But we're trying, and to me, the opportunity is clear. 
In 2018, I was sitting in my favorite chair when the Washington Capitals came back to win their series in Game 7 against the Tampa Bay Lightning. Yeah, we got some Caps fans here. It's good. And uh, I'm sure there were a few uh, Bruins fans that uh, had to face the negative experience a couple nights ago. Uh, what I would have loved was for an airline, a hotel company, and the team to all message me with offers to travel to Las Vegas for game one. That's not creepy. That's just taking the information publicly available and using it to give me something that I want. And that also extends to giving the right products to guests who travel with kids or pets. Or if you need a charger for your electric car, uh, that should come up more during your search experience for a hotel stay. As we better atomize our offerings, there are incalculable ways where we can leverage data to deliver a better overall guest experience. So where does MicroStrategy come into play here? Sitting within that digital journey I just described is loads of data. Data which can be used to be predictive and personalized, as I just mentioned, or data that can help, us make, help make us operationally better. And so that's where the power of where our tools come into play. As we capture data about what rooms people prefer, when they visit their rooms, the requests they make and message us about, think about the power of that information for your experience. The ability for data to better understand the typical windows in which people visit their room allows us to optimize our housekeeping schedules and disrupt you less. Knowing the profile of guests that typically request more towels or pillows can save us additional visits to your room. It changes how we price, changes how we service rooms, and also changes how we prepare for your stays, all to remove friction from the experience. So the tools we pro provide today uh, and will provide in the future, that brings my career journey and passion full circle. The next step is empowering 400,000 plus team members across the globe working at Hilton Hotels with the data that matters when it matters. So over the next year, we'll be massively expanding our access to MicroStrategy tools, and I'm extremely excited to see how that transforms the hotel experience for you all, the guests, and for our team members in ways that are both shockingly subtle and impactful. So if you want to hear more about how we're building a more data-driven guest experience, please do join us for our breakout. Uh, session later today. I'll be joined by Becky Polbaum, uh, our Vice President of Enterprise and Customer Analytics. I hope, as you all can tell, we are really excited about the innovations we're making. Uh, we're excited about our partnership with MicroStrategy and for the future of a more digital hospitality experience in the future. Thank you all sincerely for being here, and I hope you enjoy the rest of the conference. <laughs>